this reminds me to be grateful for the opportunities I have. Hello loves, I'm having a flu that is giving me fever. I'm feeling so unwell. <laughs> Hi loves, welcome back to the channel. So I just finished my shift, I'm at work and I'm scared of buy My throat feels very funny. I kind of shook on a home. I'm one person who feels pulls me down. So uh, I just want to change and head home to Sababu. I'm feeling very bad. Despite how I'm feeling, I appreciate me places, so it was just a must for me to arrange my locker before I leave. One thing about me, I will always ensure to check if I have my bus fare kwa sababu eh, embarrassment here. Yeah. Makanga, it's always on another level. Good morning, this is the next day. I've been really postponing on my workouts every day I wake up and tell myself I'm gonna work out the next day so I've been doing this for the last two good weeks and today I had to push myself because I woke up and I was like should I just let me just go tomorrow and then I was like okay you've been doing this for the last two weeks so I had to push myself did a 30 minutes workout it was worth it I did some stretches my body really felt better because the kind of work I do I stand for long hours so this was just worth it I'm back home watu wa mimi na imi yangu kujeni hapa so I'm in the matatu and there is a lady complaining uh, she gave somebody money to come and paint her house. She's actually talking on phone and she's like Mimi Naimi Akayangu, there's some things I can't tolerate. So it reminded me I just turned a near old. So should I also be saying Mimi Naimi Akayangu? <laughs> Always put me at the back of the vehicle. As long as there is an empty seat, I will use it. I'm back home. Need to prepare dinner. So today I did not postpone my workout. I went out very early. Unfortunately, I didn't bring you guys with me because I just wanted to have quality time to work out. I also met a friend who encouraged me to go for a run. So we went for a run, then came back, did some workouts. He also introduced me to his coach. I think he will be helping me out. I'm thinking of joining his team. Yeah, so I just want to make smoothie. This is an avocado, mango, avocado, banana, and, and milk smoothie. You can try that out. It slaps. It's a good way to start your day. I want to do this so quick because I'm getting late to work. I prefer using this tin because it's convenient to carry in my bag. So I'll just put my smoothie in this tin and then carry it to work. I'll just take it to work because I'm having limited time and I'm not yet prepared myself. Since I rushed out early, I was not able to make my bed immediately I woke up. 
I'm getting ready for work. Why am I opening my mouth? Am I using my hand or mouth? <laughs> that reminds me when you're feeding a child and you're giving the baby food, you always open your mouth as if you're the one eating. That guy needs to smell well. I didn't forget my smoothie, of course. <laughs> if you know me, you know how much I love flowers. Again, spot me at the back of the vehicle. So it's at night I'm coming back from work and I came across this cart, um, Kokoteni, it was full of these jerrycans and I just, some things just remind me to be thankful of what God has granted me. Imagine this is someone's household, as full as it is, he was pushing it. Please remember to subscribe to my channel if you watch to this point. Support me by just clicking the subscription button. And it means a lot to me. See you in my next video.